Hello my friends, welcome back to Keto in the Chaos. My name is Tammy and this is an episode of What to Eat Wednesday. First of all, I need to apologize for the lateness of this video. My life has taken a turn for the busy and I have just not been able to get these videos up. So I am going to put two weeks worth of eating into this video. I want you to keep in mind that while normally I do a higher protein, moderate fat version of keto set to maintain lean muscle mass and promote fat loss, lately I have been eating a little bit more food than normal and have been doing almost maintenance calories. So keep that in mind as you look at my meals that you might not be able to eat as much as I am eating in order to maintain a fat loss kind of situation. So make sure you're just using my meal ideas for ideas and using your own personal macros to determine how much of each thing to eat. If you need macros, don't worry, we have a chart available for you on my Facebook page, Keto Chaos. The link is in the About section below. Now let's get on to the food. Good Wednesday morning, everyone. Welcome back to Keto in the Chaos, What to Eat Wednesday. This is going to be my first meal of the day today. I have 40 grams of center cut bacon, two fried eggs, 40 grams of strawberries, 40 grams of raspberries, and 50 grams of avocado. I'm also eating one cup of 0% Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with lemonade Mio water enhancer. And that is going to be my first meal of the day. Hey everyone, we just finished up school and this is meal number two. I am having a Think Thin protein bar and two cheese sticks. Alright everyone, it's Wednesday night. I am sitting here editing my hide and seek channel vlogs and I am having five ounces of chicken breast, two ounces of provolone cheese, one half cup of Rouse marinara, and one cup of spaghetti squash. And that's going to be my last meal of the day. Hello everyone, it's Thursday, and this is going to be my first meal of the day. I have two fried eggs, 40 grams of center cut bacon, 100 grams of strawberries, 50 grams of avocado, one cup of 0% Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with lemonade Mia water enhancer. And today I'm having throat coat herbal tea with a little heavy whipping cream and stevia. And that is going to be my first meal of the day. It's Thursday night and I am having pork fajitas for dinner. I am having eight ounces of pork tenderloin with about a cup and a half or so of veggies. I didn't measure, measure my veggies tonight. Two ounces of cheddar cheese, 90 grams of salsa, 60 grams of sour cream, and that is gonna be my last meal of the day. All right, everyone, it is Friday, and this is my first meal of the day. I am having 44 grams of center cut bacon, two fried eggs. This is one ounce of cheddar cheese that I just kinda like fried in a pan so that it was a little bit crispy. And then one ounce of, no, I'm sorry, one cup of 0% Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with orange vanilla meal water enhancer. And that is going to be my first meal of the day. Hello everyone, it's 10.30 at night and we just got home from dance and I made this dinner. It is just my regular um, one and a half cups of butternut squash topped with five ounces of chicken breast and a half a cup of Rouse marinara sauce and two ounces of mozzarella cheese. And that is gonna be my last meal of the day. All right, here we go. Two eggs, 44 ounces center cut bacon, one ounce of cheese, mozzarella, and Mio yogurt. All right, and there's yeah. Happy Sunday, everyone. I'm having my first meal of the day. It is a little after 1.30. I think it's close to two o'clock now, actually. And I'm having my first meal, and this is what I'm having today. My one cup of 0% Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with lemonade meal water enhancer. Two eggs from my backyard chickens. 44 grams of center cut bacon. And this is one ounce of cheddar cheese that I just kind of fried up in a pan like a little pizza. And then for drinking, I am having throat coat herbal tea with one tablespoon of heavy whipping cream and some stevia. And that is gonna be my first meal of the day. All right, it's Sunday night, and this is going to be my last meal of the day. I'm having four chicken drumsticks, and a cup and a half of broccoli florets, some Frank's Red Hots, and then I'm gonna put some also ranch dressing on here. 
because it's just kind of like the flavor of ranch with Frank's. And that is going to be my last meal of the day. Hello everyone, it is Monday morning. I've got the kids downstairs working on their school without me. And I am up here editing. So, here's going to be my first meal of the day. It's what I eat pretty much every day. 44 grams of center cut bacon, two fried eggs, one ounce of cheddar cheese that I've just fried in a pan, and one cup of 0% Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with orange vanilla meal. And that's going to be my first meal of the day. All right, everyone. It's Monday night, and I'm having one of my favorite meals. Um, five ounces of chicken breast, two ounces of provolone cheese, one half cup of Rouse marinara sauce over a cup of zoodles. And no, a cup of spaghetti squash. And that is going to be my last meal of the day. Good, good morning, everyone. It's Tuesday, and I am having my typical breakfast. Two fried eggs. One ounce of mozzarella cheese that I fried in my pan that I cooked my eggs in. 44 grams of center-cut bacon. And one cup of 0% Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with lemonade meal and that's going to be my first meal of the day. Alrighty everyone, it is really late on Tuesday. This is going to be my last meal of the day. It's 10 o'clock at night. I just got home from dance and this is what I'm going to eat for my second meal of the day. So this is two third pound patties um, from Carl's Jr. and one side salad with ranch. I won't eat this whole ranch packet but that is going to be my last meal of the day. Is it Wednesday? Yes, it's Wednesday because it's Keto Cakes Day. Okay. Good Wednesday morning, everyone. It is the beginning of a new week, and here is what I'm going to eat for my first meal of the day. I have two fried eggs, 44 grams of center-cut bacon, one ounce of cheddar cheese that I kind of fried in the pan, and one Keto Cake because today was Keto Cakes Day, and I picked some up for Chef Dave's birthday. He's 45. And this is a peanut butter jelly. The website is www.ketocakesutah.com if you want to check them out, but I don't think that they do anything that isn't local at the moment. All right, so this is this is what I'm having for dinner. I'm going to have three pieces of this grilled chicken from El Pollo Loco, a little bit of this salad, a little bit of this broccoli, and that's going to be my last meal of the day. This is a Keto Cakes Utah Cupcake, Lime Ricky flavored. Here's my three dollar Diet Coke. <laughs> Here's my triple, Wendy's, it's after midnight, finally eating dinner. So delicious. It's basically just veggies <laughs> and some bacon. What did they say? Hope not. Oh, you were such a mess. Yeah, all you could see was the steam. some real food for once. This is an eight ounce sirloin steak and a cup of zucchini that Chef Dave made for me tonight and I am happy to eat it. And that's gonna be my last meal of the day. Good morning, it's Tuesday. I'm glad to be back and having my regular breakfast. Two fried eggs, 44 grams of center cut bacon, an ounce of provolone cheese and a cup of Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with orange vanilla meal. That's gonna be my first meal of the day. All right, it's Tuesday night, and I just got home from dance. It's a little after nine, and I am having my last meal of the day, which is six ounces of ground beef, two ounces of cheese, four ounce, no, four tablespoons of sour cream, two tablespoons of salsa, and a sprinkling of olives and onions, and about a cup of lettuce. And that's gonna be my last meal of the day, and the last meal of this video. 
Well, there you have it. Now you know what I ate for the last two weeks on keto. It was a little bit of craziness going on for there for a minute. I hope that you guys got some great ideas for your own keto meal plan. Don't forget to join our Facebook group for support and ideas on how you can create and maintain your own keto weight loss plan. Thanks so much for watching. We'll talk to you again soon.